Hi you guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you know my channel, I'm Akanksha. So in this video, it's a vlog. Wow, sensation. It's a weekend. Um, I don't know why I always end up uh, making vlogs on the weekend only, but uh, it just how it works. But oh my god, I am so stressed to talk about the weekend only because this weekend I have so much shit to do um i don't know like I, i i know i can manage i think so but then the fact that i have to kind of stresses me out as well uh so i thought i i'll add more stress to it and vlog it because why why do anybody need um, no stress in life right yeah Uh, but anyways, it's a Saturday morning. I just woke up. It's around eight thirty. <coughs> wow, my throat is also actually a little fucked because I have a uh, throat infection. I am up because I have a shoot today. I have a shoot tomorrow as well. Actually, I have shoot both the days, and I shot yesterday as well. Like when I say I have a shoot day, I usually mean when the videographers are here. Generally, when I am shooting, it's not stress. I don't take, but then I come and all. It's like a big deal for me. So. Uh, Anyways, today is a shoot day. Today I have to shoot a lot of things, uh, so that tomorrow I can have little very minimal stuff. Because tomorrow night I have a concert to go to. To tonight also I actually have a bachelor party to go to. Um, so like that's the reason I'm a little, you know, this that that I can't like have the entire day to shoot. So I have to shoot after evening. I have to go to the bachelor party. Then I have to shoot tomorrow. I have to go to the DJ Snake uh, uh, concert. So yeah, and I cannot not like you know. Film and give today content because Monday is the this is basically for Nike sale and um, the brief they have at least the you know mood board they have this time is a little you know extra and I wanted to you know give them what they asked for so I'm actually getting a setup done as well so anyways I have to shoot and for Nike sale na not just for Nike for other brands also they want to push the products right so I have a four deals to four or five deals to film in the span of just two days which is ah ha ha stressing me out even more actually. This time I'm getting the decor done basically, and I've never got like any setup down for the shoot till date. This is the first time, um, so yeah, hoping it's going to turn out okay. I just woke up. I don't want to take bath. I think I'll take bath after I'm done with the shoot before I'm getting ready for the bachelorette because I don't want to carry like the day to the party. Owen is in the balcony because the guys are in the house. He'll not let them work. He'll make them get scared. But he's such a good boy. Oh, you're such a good boy. Mun you me? He's so angry. He's like, "This is betrayal, honey. Why did you close me in the balcony?" Come on, come on. He's not giving me eye contact. You know? This is the setup they are doing right here before, and then we'll see after. You guys also in the house? The Polly guy is chic. Polly guy has been so chic lately. Polly guy, hi, hi, Anu. Hi. Hi. So she has no energy on the back of the Hi. Queen. Queen. Bah. No energy on it. So they want a pink setup. Uh, so we are doing these glitter kind of thing, panels kind of thing on the entire thing. So there's a like these are like individual sheets which they make into like a big mm -hmm. setup like that big. So, yep. Let's see. So for the uh, bachelor party, or like they're not calling it bachelor party, they're calling it the pre-wedding party. But I am calling it bachelor party. I got these fun little games. Um, I want to see. Like I've been seeing this online for so long that I, um, you know, like this is the time to get it. I just want to open it. Give me one minute. Do I not tell anybody I'm buying? So I want to go see what they say. Um, if anybody will play or not. So the US one, I think that's how it got famous, like these things. But like that US one is like next level, bro. But like you know, oh, a bell. I don't, I don't know the rules of the game. We have to like probably um, you know sit and figure that out. God knows who will do it in that state. But it comes with not sponsored by the way. Divide with two teams. Each each team sends out one representative. Representative each for arm wrestling. The losing team drinks three sips each. I mean, this is fun. Take out a final note and give it to a person who successfully draw downs their drink and guesses correctly. If the last digit digit of that note is even or ah. Uh -huh. 
uh, guess if it's odd or even. Oh, fun, fun, fun. I like it. I, I got actually one more game also. So this one is called um, Damshrat. Oh yeah, so they even had like a Bollywood thing and they had like buy two. I think if you get like 10% or 20% off. So I got one more thing which is called Damshrat also. So it's like act or gets lost. Oh, you have to act like you're farting. Oh, this Damshrat. Or if you don't act, you have to have two sips of your drink. Next is act like Superman. Then what? Um... Why? <laughs> Fun. So many guys are going to do shit today then. I'm not sure how. Like there's so many people and like not everybody will be comfortable. And especially the guy who's getting married, he's so little. Very low-key. Look at this guy. Every time I open packages, he comes and stands here because I give him bubble wrap. <laughs> but this time I am not giving him bubble wrap because I only don't have any bubble wrap. Come and do this. If I give him plastic to tear. Oh, there is this as well. So cute. Basically, I think you need to do the task within the time that this gets over. So if you don't, then you have to take a sip of whatever you are drinking. So this is what they've done. Now, um, it, it does seem a little extra. I feel like now that I <laughs> the setup is there, I'm like, itna effort why am I putting? Uh, but... Uh, yeah, this is how it looks. Like, it's pretty nice though. Not just for, uh, you know, Nike. I, and now I feel like I should film something else, like a normal reel, like, you know, for me, myself also. Because I did like, it's not this ex this much extra work has been done. Uh, this is the first time, like I told you, I got a setup done. So I feel like it's a little too much uh, effort or like I spent money and then this. But then, yeah, I don't take any lighting because I have this light, which I feel like, you know, will give the vibe like that pink wala more so i actually wanted this one these are rose gold right but i wanted these like in pink which they unfortunately did not have so i had to go with the rose gold thing and then i can put this pink light and yeah pretty cool like i can stand right there and it'll look exactly like what they gave i'll i'll show you guys the mood board actually what they gave so why you know why i like you know did this setup and stuff but i could have my gucci on Okay, setup is done. Kishore is also here. Hi, Kishore. The pink lord banana on that. So done. Get lost. The kasha. Banana. So what I'm saying is this. Okay, I got done with the shoot. I could not give an update at home, but I'm out here taking Moon on a walk. Um, yeah, I am literally kind of really exhausted. I shot so many things today, though. I'm so proud of myself. I need to shoot a couple more too. I thought I'll do that once I'm like, you know, getting ready to go out to that uh, wedding party. Um, but yeah, I shot like three reels and um, statics. I shot like, I think five stories. I need two, three stories more, but um, I'm here to give him a walk. I need to at least give him a 30 to 40 minutes walk because he's a very like energetic dog and I don't want him to like, you know, be disruptive at home if I don't give him this walk. And it's already like seven. I need to go all the way, travel all the way one hour for the party. I don't know when I'm going to get ready and when I'm going to go. But yeah, the night is young and it's not like I can stay back in my friend's place as well because tomorrow also I have a shoot and I need to come back in the night for that and I have to take this guy to the walk also in the morning. So yeah, like I would really suggest you to not take a dog if you have nobody to depend on and uh, if you like, you know, are just, just figuring out shit and you don't have like a routine because dog responsibility is like huge, bro. But yeah, look at this cutie. 
Hello, Monyo. Good boy, ma. Chalo, let's go. I have this front lip harness for him these days because he pulls a lot when he's walking. So I kind of hold him right there and he walks and his walks have become a lot better. Oh, wow, I'm a dog training channel also now. Yay. And I'm on. Moon, 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 moon. Good boy. Come here. Come here. Good job. Look at him. Let's link to my instructions. Chalo, let's go. Let's go. Okay. Came back home, got ready, and this is what I did. I did like sleek hair, nude little makeup, and I'm wearing this black sweater kind of dress with this bag. And I am off to the party. Absolutely love my face. Like the makeup is just. Uh -huh. Hi, you guys. Another day. Um, the bachelor day, bachelor. I don't know why I keep saying bachelorette. Poor guys, it was bachelor. And I, I do not say it's like I don't remember what I said in the previous part. But there, everybody was saying bachelorette, bachelorette. And he was like, bro, it's bachelors, not bachelorette. So in my mind now, it's like bachelorette only. But yeah, I could not record anything there. It was like a lot of people um were there. Some you know, a lot of people I don't know. A lot of people I know. But yeah, but that was um two days ago. Uh, then I. Next day, actually, after that, I had like next day morning when I came back, I had like a lot of editing and stuff to do. So I woke up, I did a lot of like whatever I shot, shot on Saturday. I had to edit everything and give off before um, like, you know, four or five because I had to go to for a DJ Snake concert. I got actually vlog Sunday also, but then I had so much work piled up from the morning. I woke up, I was just sitting and editing. There was not much to show as well. And one of my friends had come over and then we went to DJ Snake concert, which was quite upsetting. It was so boring. I actually not like it personally. I went only very late and after that, I came back also pretty early because I feel like he was honestly stuck in 20 you know 18 19 only because like the playlist honestly was not my um you know to like my liking so I don't like it and there was so much crowd oh my god I think it was a little new also because since college I do not go anywhere like you know concert wise so it was like okay back to this and I was like I can't believe I did this that time but now I feel like after pandemic to see so much crowd in one place and I'm like <sighs> Hmm. But anyways, we came back and um, I, I have severe cold yesterday was more worse today. It's still better. I think you can understand my voice. I'm trying not to like, you know, put it out. But um, I have like, you know, where's my hanky? It's always with me. I'm just, you know, constantly having dozy and stuff. Um, but yeah, yesterday I was feeling pretty like weak and all because of cold even today, but I had some work to do. I just finished it. I had to shoot something. Uh, so I just did that. And I really want to go get a haircut, man, because it's been seven months and like my hair ends and everything have kind of grown out and like I don't have a whole lot of volume left on the crown as well and you you see this part like um, the hair color has grown out as well so back in April only I got my hair color and my hair kind of grew this much now hair color I'm not really sure I want to like go ask him if he can just do this part if so then I'll get it done because I don't want to again color this entire thing because this and all is pretty fine so if you can do touch ups only from the top I would love that I can ask I'll ask him if he can do that then I'll get that done or else then I'll just do like haircut and come back because again tomorrow also I have shoot and I have no time to go tomorrow but um and also want to make myself feel a little better if if he doesn't have hair color then I probably will get a spa done or something because my hair honestly needs help look at it it's so dry man like it's so dry dead I take care of I'm trying to take care of it a lot these days, but um, yeah, I've done a lot of damage by heat and all. Um, my nose is so blocked when I'm talking. I'm like, what am I even saying? But yeah, let's go get a haircut. And this is so I've, I'll change now. Anyways, this was the shoot kill I wore. The, you want to see my amazing outfit? This is what I'm wearing turtleneck and Nietzsche. I'm wearing a um, night um, dress kind of thing. This is what happens in shoots. But let's go get a haircut. Okay, this is what I'm wearing, black pants. Now this is actually a shirt, but I'm trying to wear it like a, what do you say? <clears throat> a jacket or something. And yeah, crop top, let's go. You know what I did? I did something really nice. I um, forgot to change my um, gharka slippers and I wore them only outside as well. So I'm wearing pink chapal, white and black, white and black outfit. I am in no, 
have no patience to go and change. So we are going to go out like this only. Pink chappals in the bath. Bathroom chappal, you know. Bathroom. I think only good hair color jayshan hai. Inter mein ke liya. So only pina touch up jayo cha. So only pina touch up. Okay, so back home, and this is how my hair looks. So I just did touch up on the top, so you can see like really light blend of streaks that he did. I could not do balayage for the top part because um you know it's just like this much. He said if you wait for like one one and a half month, it will grow a little more, and that time we can do. But then I went today, and I was like, I don't want to wait. So we did like um you know tiny streaks just to kind of blend everything um together, and I like how it turned out. Coming to my haircut, um you you. See the lower part of the color we did not touch at all. So you can see like this remains the same. This is like one of my favorite uh, colors. Like I love how this uh, looks. And for the haircut also, it like looks really nice. So coming to the haircut, um, so I've always just done layers for my hair. And this time he said he like last time I basically did multi layers or something. And this time he did deep layers. So I'll just put clips of what he did. Like once he did like the layers necessarily. In the end, he um kind of thinned out the ends and etc. So that because especially after haircut, haircut you sometimes don't like your hair see because everything all the ends are so chunky and you don't see that like proper cut until after a month after the haircut. So I think this probably helps with that factor. So he took all the ends and he kind of thinned them out and like he did something to give me like more layers and for it to look like you know I have so much going on, which I think looks uh, really pretty. Next is color. Color. This time I asked the details properly. It is six point three five. So basically six point three five can go like way light. It can go like blonde types, but um. What these people do is they do they use six point three five, but they keep checking like in intervals to see if we've achieved like we reach the point where we are satisfied with the color. Like basically, if the, the color is what uh, we want, they kind of wet it off so that you know it does not um, you know increase more or get more lighter. So he said, for, if you want to do it yourself, you can use twelve point three five. Basically, I think you should put that for like one hour or something. And if you put the six point three five, you just have to keep it for like half an hour. And um, this is the color I have. I feel like this is the perfect color. Um, you know it's not too much it's not too uh, less as well like it just looks beautiful uh, this is one of my like you know i did i did hair color before as well but uh, last time and this time the color i have is um, one of my favorite you can see it's that brown and but it's not that reddish copperish brown it's that neutral brown which looks like really pretty one thing though like i i would say about most of the salons is like you know this guy does a pretty good job my hair cut i've been doing um, um near him like 
for ages now i don't even remember like seven to eight years but hair color i did like the last time and this time and they do a pretty good job but you need to know what you want not just here like any salon because everybody has a way they do it and the way they like it so usually that's what they implement on the clients as well but that's probably not what you want so you either find somebody who does exactly um you know has the same taste as you or you have to know what exactly you want so that you can sit and explain to them exactly or else you know in the end if you don't like it you'll you know you know regret it's your money at the end of the day like today there was one streak which was too strong i did not like it and i made him redo it again because it was just like the odd one out so you need to know what you want so that you can tell them also properly if you're confused they're confused your hair will get um, messed up but see how beautifully this brown is blended like all this part was grown out it was still here so they're just like nice thin thin like streaks in between so that it's not like you know too blank see that ha so yeah that's about it i just came home i'm extremely tired you can obviously see on my face i really want to just like you know ha eat and sleep this video shout out goes to sahana aleti thank you sahana for always loving and supporting me it absolutely means the world to me if you want to be part of next video shout out then all you have to do is comment below and use the hashtag aks and you can be a part and that's about it for this video i'll see you guys in my next one